Rashida Ganuni designs and sews clothes to sell in the market. She started her company alone with this basic machine handed down by her mother. It hasn't been easy. I think this model will work out well. I'm doing my best for it. She has managed to create her own brand and found clients she can sell in bulk to. Today, Rashida employs three women and helps four families, including her own, to make a living. Our times are difficult, and a man alone cannot do it all. How much are they going to make, with children in school, and rent, and so on? So a man alone cannot make it. Women have to work, and also they will be independent, and they won't have to ask their husbands for money. Rashida couldn't have achieved this without help from a local non-profit organization. It works closely with women entrepreneurs. Asma is the founder of the Tunisian Center for Social Entrepreneurship. She says women often find it harder to set up a business. The bureaucracy is even more aggressive with women rather than men. Sometimes we have uh, obstacles uh, which are not really related to the system but also to, to the mentality and to the attitudes of the people working in the administration or in the bank. Rashida wants to grow her business and move to a larger workshop. Rashida's story is an inspiration to many Tunisian women. It shows that they can too be successful entrepreneurs, helping their community and their families become independent. Yusuf Geji, CCTV, Tunis.